Metro Home Building Center starting gate is rolling here for race number eight from Red Shores and Summerside this afternoon. Let's go back upstairs to track announcer Vance Cameron for the race call. Pocket of Aces, Morian Bay, Prince Hal. Watch him treasure, head of state Mitch. Stash it away, J.J. Tommy in the grandstand side. Two-year roll cold faces in the PEI cold stakes. Top of the stretch. Here they come. The rough end pacing Prince Hal leaving out. Morian Bay goes with him third to the turn. Watch him treasure from the far outside. J.J. Tommy is there fourth. Fifth at the rail pocket of aces. Then around the turn and racing from sixth. That is head of state. Mitch got away seventh. And then the trailer is stash it away. So the post time favorite is last in the early going. Up front on the lead is Prince Hal in line to Brody McPhee. Morian Bay tucked away for the two hole ride. Then in third. That's watch him treasure. Fourth at the rail is J.J. Tommy. Racing from fifth. Pocket of aces, 30, and two was the quarter. Then six, around the turn is head of state. Racing seventh is Mitch, and on the outside, the trailer. That is stash it away. They move off the turn and straighten down the stretch. They have the half mile in their sights, and Prince Hal is the leader on Morian Bay from the outside and coming first up. That is watch him treasure, and he's got broken gear at the half. Then in fourth is J.J. Tommy, opening half mile in 101 and 1. The tempo will pick up in here as they move around the turn, arriving at the 5-8. Prince Hal, the leader. Second is Morian Bay from the outside. Watch him treasure third. J.J. Tommy coming three wide fourth. Then in fifth pocket of aces. Stash it away now is in the contention six. He rolls up three wide. Then seventh. That's head of state. Mitch at the rail. The trailer. They're by three quarters. We have a new leader, J.J. Tommy, three quarters up in one, 31 and one, J.J. Tommy takes over with an eighth to go, stash it away, lands on the scene late, coming second on the outside, Prince Hal back to third, Morian Bay coming on between horses, deep in the stretch now, as they land on the line, from worst to first, stash it away for Campbell in the PEI Colt Stakes. J.J. Tommy second, Morian Bay third, two minutes, three fives. Okay, well, we talked about it in the pre-race. He had post seven, stashed it away here, and uh, he was at the back early on. But boy, did he make up a ton of ground, especially second part of the mile here tonight. For sure. He got away at the back of the pack, as you mentioned, but just followed that third overflow as the four watch him, Treasure and Heffernan. They came first up here today, and uh, second over trip goes to J.J. Tommy and Arsenault. But it was the uh, three, Brody McPhee and Prince Hal, cutting it out 30 and 2, 101 and 1, 131 and 1. Arsenault tipped off that second over cover down the lane. And our third over cover was Mark Campbell timing it perfectly here with Stash It Away. And those two horses battled down the lane, but Stash It Away gets up in the final strides to nail it here. Time of the mile, two minutes, three fifths. And we'll see them back in the Woodmere Standard Breads Winter Circle in just a moment. Well, I'm sure he had the punters a little nervous in the early going, but this colt, he stepped up, and he's arriving at the winner's circle here in the afternoon's eighth race. Number seven, stash it away. Bay Pacing Gelding 2 by Peng Shui. 
from the Panderosa Dam, All-American Napa, owned by Reg McPherson of Stratford, the colt bred by Wilford Poulton, trained by Kevin McLean, driven to victory by Mark Campbell to a maiden record of two minutes and three fifths. Stash it away in the PEI Colt Stakes for two-year-old Colt Pacers down at Trackside Cam McPhee and Scott Rollison with the presentation. <laughs> 